Ho ho ho! Welcome to Rekka Christmas Market! that you were talking to honey makers. You're a busy bee. So here on Corso on the main promenade, allegedly there's a record number of vendors this year, even 21. So on this 21 vendors, I'm sure you can find something wonderful that you would like to taste, buy, bring home or uh, give a gift to your loved one. hungry as I specifically instructed you to. I guess we just need to drink some wine. <laughs> oh. So the food that's being offered here is actually kind of typical Christmas food for this region. Uh, there's a lot of sausages, cabbage, uh, from sweets we have traditional frittule and of course there is mulled wine. The prices are kind of going up every year as if our paychecks were also going up except they're not. But you know, if you want to enjoy this uh, Christmas market to the full, you have to give a little bit of money. So we packed up and went to the hill to Tresad Castle, our final stop for the night. Very glowy, it's full of light and a nice Christmas atmosphere. Tell me honestly, what do you think about the lights? Do you think they're a little bit too much or we like them like this? So we are going to start our mission uh, to find something very nice to eat and uh, explore what's in the offer. I'm going to try to fill it. Uh, 
as we found out by coming here and having a chat with a wonderful chef uh, over there, um, it's not you. <laughs> Apparently there's a far lesser, smaller amount of the little houses and the offer this year. Probably, I mean, must be because of COVID. Otherwise, uh, the offer would be much bigger. So, yeah, as you can see, it's very, you know, it's getting crowded as the night is falling because it's Saturday and people are actually enjoying to come outside of the house for, especially for like a nice occasion like this. Yeah, who can blame them, you know? But it would be better if the COVID measures are respected a little bit more. <laughs> Look at all this beautiful light! <laughs> so, let's pick our favorite location for the Christmas market. Is it the city center, is it by the theater, or here? Well, I would say that they're all equally good, but if you prefer to see a lot of lights, then this is your place to go. Uh, they're more beautiful in the night though. And about the offer of food and drinks, um, well, here is very nice and cozy, and also we met a really nice uh, uh, chef. <laughs> and in the end, what do I say? I mean, what do we say? Would we recommend you to visit the Christmas market in the Gay Cup? Yeah, of course we would. So even though Geka is not your typical uh, Christmas fairy tale because, you know, it doesn't have snow and it's not so cold, uh, it's still really nice to visit because, come on, we are on the seaside and also Geka is so special that I always mention in my videos. What do you think? Does your city have a better Christmas market than we do? Tell me why! <laughs> Thank you for watching this video, uh, give me a like if you enjoyed it and tell your friends about me.